Hi, this is Bob Paskins. I am a sales consultant as well as the creator of The Growth Matrix, where we look to elevate salespeople and sales processes to achieve desired growth. Today, we're gonna to talk about the superpower of storytelling. And this is found in the discovery element of The Growth Matrix. HubSpot recently did a survey where they interviewed participants who had seen sales presentations. What they found was that 63% of the participants remembered the stories the salespeople told, and only 5% remembered the data that was shared. Using this should actually empower you to construct stories for your sales presentations. But how do you do that? Let me tell you the three components that are needed for a good story for salespeople. The first one is simply what I call identify the problem. What you need to do when you're reaching out to your potential customers is identify their problem. I know that's basically sales 101. If you don't have a problem that you can solve for your customers, what are you doing trying to sell to them in the first place? They aren't actually the customers that you are trying to pursue. Think for a minute of your favorite movie or favorite story. I can guarantee you that there was a problem that needed to be solved within that storybook framework. And usually that problem hit somewhere early on in the movie or in the book. It's very similar to as you are constructing your sales story. You want to quickly identify the problem that your potential customer had. The second component is the actual solution. What the actual solution provides is how your product or service solved the need for your customer. By implementing the product or service, your customer's problem then went away. The third component is the emotional solution. Highlighting the emotional solution helps your customer identify where they were before your solution was in place to where they are now. It is incredibly powerful when used well. This might be the most important part of the story. It is the hook that gets you in the end. So with those three components, your job is to create a four to six sentence story, which encapsulates the problem, the actual solution, and the emotional solution. Putting that together, you should be able to recite that in roughly 30 seconds. I encourage you to actually memorize this story from start to finish so it can just roll off your tongue. Not only that, I encourage you to have a caveat of about 10 of these stories ready to be used so that when your prospect states a particular problem, you are able to quickly roll out the story, which would show how you transform another client that you've worked with. Part of my sales training is to work with companies to identify construct and tell these stories so that when they are meeting with a client, they can quickly identify what story they can pull from their database to use for their potential customer. If you would like help in constructing these stories, feel free to reach out to me at my website at bobpaskins.com. Thanks for watching.